GA Congress has voted in favour of a revamped tiered All Ireland Football Championship. It's an All Ireland series, and away we go. Absolutely brilliant play. And Cork have got the victory. And it's a good point, it's a great point. A thrilling game of football. Clinical from Shepherd. Johnny Gall have done it. Oh my, have been going. The new story begins today. It's just under two weeks since Galway retained the Nestor Cup with that dramatic late winner, whereas Derry have had a full four weeks to re-energise and focus on the All-Ireland series. Unlike in the Connacht final, Galway this time are going to start with John Maher and Shane Walsh. And there's also a very late call-up for Matthew Tierney coming into the half-forward line. Derry make four changes following the loss to Dunny Gall. Gareth McKinless and Niall Toner, they'll both start, and they have late call-ups as well for Emmett Bradley and Declan Cassidy. In as far as Brendan Rodgers, now Conor McCluskey will bring plenty of energy when Derry go on the attack. Ethan Doherty played the pass in originally for the first score of the match and this is Bradley looking for the second one and Emmett Bradley announces his return to the starting 15 for Derry by getting a championship score here Mickey Hart hoping that for the first time a Derry side can beat a Galway side in the championship here's an opportunity really good opportunity for Matthew Tierney and Tierney from inside the D and up and over the crossbar Nice breakaway by Galway. Derry relaxed their control of the defensive situation. Picked up here by Ethan Doherty. Back to McCluskey again. Inevitably, Doherty is making himself available. Man has scored four points in the loss against Donny Gall in the quarterfinal of the Ulster Championship. That's back there as far as Kieran McFall to restore Derry's lead again. That was good play by Derry. They're so economical, quick and decisive. Sean Fitzgerald. Jacqueline. Paul Conroy. Nicely done in there as far as Shane Walsh looking to exert an influence on this match. Maher. Here's a chance. Very tight angle by Finnerty. And he's put it over the crossbar. Superb point there by Rob Finnerty, levelling up the game at four points apiece. Very quick kick out. Derry were attacking, now they're defending because Tierney is feeding it forward to Finnerty and giving it back to Tierney once again, laying it off as far as Comer. And then it was Gareth McKinless who made contact with him. Crowd on its feet, paying for a card. And a red card is issued. And Derry are down to 14 players. It's what happened afterwards here. Very good spot by the officials. There was a stamp there by McKinless and definite red card. John Daly. Out into the left-hand side where Sean Kelly is there stretching the Derry defence. Conroy backing himself, following through beautifully. Lovely kick. Second of the day for Paul Conroy. Paul Cassidy and his brother here, Declan. Ba Bradley again, fancying it on the left, and again it drops short. And that's another scoring opportunity that Derry have missed. An awful lot of shots dropping into the goalkeeper's hands. Johnny Heaney now, the Killanon player, able to get it all the way down along the line to John Maher. Didn't start the college final, they brought him on before half time, getting away from. Derry challenges, back out as far as Dylan McHugh, into space to John Daly, putting his left boot through it and putting it up and over the crossbar as well. His fourth ever championship score and he makes it eight points to five. Ethan Doherty. Kelly is there tracking him, all the way down in towards McFall, looking to cut back. Doherty. Glasses behind him. Bit static, might work out yet. It very well might, and it has. Connor Glass cut inside, eyed the target, and made it eight points to seven. Rogers playing it in here. McGuigan once again, looking to try and get something. Back out as far as Lachlan Murray, and that 
is an equaliser. Two in a row by Derry. They're far from finished. They may be a man down, but they're level in this match for the fifth time. Highly competitive contest, as was anticipated. That's a terrible kick out there by Oren Lynch. Galway can come again here. Kelly stopped on the line and finished. The opening goal of the game, scored by Galway. And the goal is scored by Sean Kelly. Terrible kick out there. Won well by Galway. They were looking much livelier. This was Sean Kelly. Stopped on the line there well by Dermot Baker, but finished superbly. And Galway strike here for the opening goal of the game. Matthew Tierney playing it ahead here. Real opportunity. Another rasping shot up and over. He's come good, Shane Walsh. That's two in a row. Emmett Bradley, goalkeeper, was coming one way. He was going the other way. They're throwing caution to the wind at this stage, as Derry teams have done. This is McFall going this way, that way. He's still motoring. He's still going. Oh, what a point by Kieran McFall. Nobody able to get a shoulder on him. Bernard Rogers. Nice change of direction to try and go by Rob Finnerty, but they're still a fair old distance from the target. Goalkeeper required. Nice ball, he picks out Mulholland. And in the end, Lachlan Murray. And that is another one. They're not finished just yet, and Lachlan Murray has got three. And now I think the Galway fans up on that stand are fearing every dairy attack that it'll produce something special. And Conor McCluskey is always capable. Pushing the team forward. McFall booming it in there. Into McGuigan and saved by the goalkeeper. Back out as far as Dylan McHugh. McGuigan's shot was straight at Gil Gleeson, but he was well positioned. And now Galway can counter-attack. And Derry are going to have to retreat quickly. Shane Walsh, nice ball forward. Here's an opportunity for Keon Darcy. Back outside, it comes again. O'Flaherty, and Darcy has scored. A second Galway goal, scored by Keon Darcy, his second ever championship score. Coming as it does in the 64th minute, and making it 2-13 to 13 points. Galway working it out of defence. We played the five minutes of stoppage time, and there goes the final whistle, and it's first blood in the group section to Galway. The final score in Pierce Stadium reads, Galway two goals and 14 points, Derry 15 points. Tough going, obviously, because Derry are, Derry are a serious outfit. Um, but it was, yeah, I think we played well. Uh, maybe it took us a while to go, get going in the first half, but um, yeah, we could kick some good scores. And I probably the sending off is probably a big, big part of the game. So um, uh, yeah, it's great. I uh, look forward to two weeks' time now.